what a bad day to rain. If it doesn't stop raining soon, we'll have to cancel our jungle safari. Don't worry, boys. I'm sure it will stop raining soon. Otherwise, we will plan something else. Hey, guys. Boy, it is pouring out there. Tell us about it. Oh, cheer up, Joe. I have something exciting to tell you. I had gone into the jungle to check our camping site. I saw something there. Huh? What did you see? I saw Mowgli, Bagheera, Baloo, Ka, and even Shere Khan today. Who are they? So far, I had only heard of them. Mowgli is a human child who lives in the jungle. Let me tell you from the beginning. A few years ago, Bagheera the panther found a two-year-old human child in the depths of the forest. <laughs> Thinking that it must have come from the nearby human settlement, Bagheera took him there. But the settlement had caught fire, and Bagheera couldn't reach it. I must find him a safe home within the forest. He will need a family. Akila, you are the head of the wolf family. The whole jungle respects you. Won't you accept one more in your family? Bagheera, how can someone say no to you? I shall do whatever you think wise. <laughs> the human child will grow and learn with my family. What shall we call him? Call him Mowgli. Bagheera! Shere Khan is coming this way! He is after Mowgli once again! Run! Huh? Baloo, go with him! Get out of my way, Bagheera. This is between the boy and me. It is the rule of the jungle. The boy is under the protection of Akila and me. The rule of the jungle is that I get what I want. Besides, the boy's kind owes me. You might have won this fight, Bagheera. But remember, I will come back for the human child. Mm. 
I must go find him! You are feeling sleepy, Mowgli. It is okay to fall asleep. with the boy. Nothing. I have only helped him remember the truth about his father and how Sheer Khan killed him. That was not your story to tell him. Nevertheless, he knows now. You saw all this in the same forest where we are going? Let's go! I want to see Mowgli too! It has stopped raining! Okay, let's go. But remember, the jungle is dangerous. Uh huh. Uh -huh. So I will create a protective shield around us all. It will also help you understand the language of the animals. Right, Bagheera? Yes, he is fine. Shere Khan killed my father and set the human village on fire. I must take revenge. You will have your revenge when the time is right. Hmm? There is no need to invite trouble. Shere Khan, 
I was waiting to see you. We shall settle this forever. You're ready to die, I see. of you. You are nothing but a coward. Don't try to mock me, boy. You will suffer the same fate as your father. Maybe I will ruin your other eye, too, before I go. Are you all right? Yes. Your courage has freed the forest of its evil today. That was exciting. Yes, but I never want to do it again. You know what I want to do? What? This is my 
my sister Gretel. We are lost and looking for our way back home. By any chance, have you guys seen a small wooden house by the river? Hmm. You guys are very far from home. What are you doing this far from home? <laughs> hey, don't you worry now, Gretel. We will drop you to home. We just need to find the old witch's house made of candy, get the ancient recipe, and we will be on our way in no time. The old witch? She tried to eat us! But she's dead now. What? what? Whoa! How did this happen? It's a long story. Let's get your recipe. I will tell everything on the way. We live outside the large woods with our dad and stepmother. Dad goes to town to sell the wood, but it's not enough to break bread every day. Stepmother doesn't care for anyone else rather than herself. Four weeks ago, me and Gretel were playing outside the house. But then, we heard loud voices started coming from the house. We don't have enough bread for everyone. How will we survive like this? <sighs> I don't know. I just want everyone to be happy. Do you? I certainly am not happy. Are you? I do all I can. Tell me what you want to do. I will do it if it makes you happy. Hmm. <laughs> I will tell you what we can do. We can leave your kids in the deep forest. No! Anything but that! How can you ever think of that? Then we will all die of hunger. Is that what you want? <laughs> Tomorrow, I will take your kids to the deep forest. I will tell them I need help gathering wood. When they get tired and fall asleep, I will come back home and leave them there. <laughs> but wild animals will eat them alive! <laughs> That's their fate. <laughs> Don't you cry, little sister. Everything will be all right. What will become of us? What will we do now? Oh, don't you worry. I will think of something. Children, come inside and take your bread. For the last time, you little rats. <laughs> Here, this is all we have for dinner today. Go to your room and eat. Yes, yes mother. mother. we can do about it. Hansel, aren't you going to eat your bread? No, I have an idea. Wake up, chill. 
children. Hurry up. We need to go to the forest and get wood. Isn't Dad coming along? No, your father is sick. Cry, little sister. I have left a trail of breadcrumbs back to home. Let's look for it. We will be home in no time. Find a place to stay. were lost and were very hungry and when we saw your house made up of candy we couldn't stop ourselves you would sound like a lovely little boy come here kid you come inside my house and eat whatever you like. You can always leave in the morning. The two shall not escape. 
escape. I will have my feast. <laughs> for your brother. He must remain in that stall and get fat. And when he is fat enough, I shall eat him. <laughs> some pearls and gold because we think mother and father will be happy and we don't have to worry about food ever again. I am so impressed. You guys are very brave. Call the ship. In the meantime, me and Ju will get the recipe. <coughs> it smells. 
smells so bad in here. Jack, there! We found the location of your house. We'll be there in no time. We have the recipe! Let's go, guys! Mother would like us back. I am sure everything will be fine. Guys, we have reached! Friends. 